Scoo, there are toys incoming. Might I suggest that you engage our new super review mode? Oh, I split! The Knight Rider TV show was pretty cool. Yeah. Well, I remember it as being cool. It's You sort of watch it now and you're like, oh my goodness, what the heck is this? I, I try not to watch it again so I can just <laughs> live on those positive memories of it rather than putting it to the test. It's a really basic premise, isn't it? It's just it a man and a car that has a voice. Yeah. Um, what was the inspiration behind all of that? I have no idea. <laughs> no. So what made you want to get uh, some toys from the uh, classic Knight Rider? Knight Rider was cool back in the day. <laughs> yeah, back in the day. <laughs> Regardless of the quality of the show itself, you've got to admit that Kit the car always looked really cool and stylish. Yeah. So when Diamond Select actually did these sort of 118 scale versions of it, it was something which I had an eye on, and I really particularly liked the Super Pursuit mode, which was introduced in later seasons okay. of the original series when they wanted to go really fast. What's the difference between regular kit and the Super Pursuit Mode kit? Okay. Well, if you take a look at this version, you can see there's a whole bunch of areas where there's sort of like little white bits, they're little extensions where the car mm. has had bits pop out. And basically, those are all the sections which, once collapsed back in, become classic kit. Yeah. Which is, you know, a, a classic black Trans Am. So you've bought this one? I have. And I've also included the Michael Knight, which came with an exclusive version of the regular kit. Okay. Because, as far as I'm concerned, there's no point having Kit if you don't have somebody to ride in him. And that's Michael Knight. You really should have the two of them together. Although he can drive by himself. He can. Kit. Yeah. But it's a lot less fun. Yeah. You know, otherwise, who's Kit going to talk back to himself? <laughs> I mean, what's wrong with the little companionship? Huh? So what kind of details and features and functions and awesome stuff does it have on? Yeah. Well, as you can see, unfortunately none of the, the bits do collapse in, so you are in Super Pursuit mode all the time, which is great because you can go really, really fast. <laughs> but you do have opening doors, so you can get your figures in and out. Good. And the rest of it is really light and sound functions. Yeah. Um, you have the gas cap here, which if you press... All systems functioning. So you do get a wonderful combination of the front light going from side to side, mm -hmm. you have William Daniels, the original voice of Kit, in there, and you also get some lights inside the cockpit just on the dashboard lighting up as well, which oh, is cool. a, a nice combination of things, and you really feel that that's the sort of thing that you should have for a toy of Kit when he's talking. Absolutely. It wouldn't be the same if, it wasn't, if, if, if Kit wasn't talking. Yeah. I mean, sure, he'd look cool, but really... Kit talks, that's what makes him Kit. And the light on the front, I mean you've got to have that light, that's exactly. really cool. And you've got a number of different sounds that he makes. And you even have the tail lights light up as well. Cool. And it's, it's kind of neat that the tail lights don't light up for every single sound that he makes, it's only the ones where it's got a sort of uh, car sound in there as well, mm -hmm. rather than just him talking. <laughs> It's an iconic car from a, I guess you could argue an iconic television series. Definitely iconic for the 80s. Yeah, and definitely worth having in toy form. Yeah, it's this really good scale which is great, lots of detail, lots of attention to detail, yeah. and some really smart electronics in there as well, which you, know, you could have a really cool car without any of the electronics in there, mm. but the way that they've incorporated really does add to it nicely. I am the voice of Night Industry 2000's microprocessor kit if you prefer. So that was Kit from Knight Rider by Diamond Select. Uh, he's in his super pursuit mode, right? Definitely. Very cool toy. Very cool toy. Uh, tell us what you think of him down below. We're out of here for now. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, all of that stuff, and we'll see you next time.